Melanie Dosromedos of Lake Hawea enjoys making functional ceramics by hand, which, unlike factory-produced pieces, have each work slightly unique, finger marks and all. Yeah, the, um, the maker's mark is a big thing at the moment and I, I think because of, you know, we're really into our technology um, and uh, this is maybe why ceramics is really coming to the forefront again. While she'd like to move back to her first um, love of making more artistic sculptural works and vases, she says the current trend is for functional wear. I suppose you can look at ceramics in a, uh, a fashion sense. So when it comes to domestic wear and functional wear, people want what is in trend and the way to stay around for a long period of time is to follow that trend just like fashion. And she acknowledges it's easy for potters to get trapped into creating en masse. When you do start working for people um, or restaurants, even though it's your base design, um, you start to lose a little bit of creativity when it comes to choice of glazes because they might want a certain colourway. Taking on students by donation, she shared her skills with others, helping build up a local pottery community. As people want to reconnect, make their own or just have that, that sense of uh, um, connection to the earth and, uh, um, you know, Having something handmade or making something yourself is really a beautiful feeling when you're eating and drinking it and you're really proud of it. And there's no shortage of handmade ceramic cups and plates in her own kitchen cupboards. And there's certain pieces that I keep. A lot of them are seconds. <laughs> so I've got a lot of mix match in my house, but uh, um, it's still, you know, I still get, oh, you know, I made this sort of feeling, yeah. In Lake Hawea, the South today.